All right, let's see. I'm already nervous. Oh my God. All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Strength Classroom. Today I'm showing you a brand new addition to my home gym. I had to say goodbye to some stuff so I could offset the cost of this bar. It's something I've wanted for a long time. I didn't think there was any difference between using this and a steel bar. I'll go grab it, put it on the rack, and we'll test it out. All right, this is what's known as the Rhino Flex HD bar. It can hold 600 pounds. It only weighs 11 pounds. Now this gives a much different feel than an actual barbell. And what's cool is you can space out the weights to make it feel different than a regular barbell. Watch this. Now, as you can see, the weights are now right up against the collar, which gives a very unique feel. Now the weights kind of bounce a little bit at the top. Let me put more weight and it's more exaggerated. It does say in the manual, if you plan to put anything above 225 pounds to put it right up against the collars, obviously it might be some sort of safety risk of the bar snapping if you put too much weight loaded on the bar this way. But uh, just that right there, with that little weight, all my stabilizers and muscles I've never felt before benching completely turned on. Let's try hanging bands from the bar. So as you can see, it's a bit of a pain if you have to put a 45 on one side because the bar only weighs 11 pounds, it's gonna tip. So what I suggest is you counterbalance it on one side first and then add weight. All right, that chain method was good. I know you might not all have chains, but you can figure it out some way how to counterbalance it. If you have two people, it's a piece of cake. All right, for that only being 100 pounds, that was a hell of a lot of shape. Let's add some more weight. All right, let's see, I'm already nervous. Oh my. Holy shit! Try that again. Oh! Alright, so as you can see, this bar is no joke. Fires up the stabilizers. Just crazy instability. Get strong on this, you'll definitely be stronger on a real, normal bench press. If you have any questions for me, topic requests, drop them in the comments, and as always, class is dismissed.